Okay, here we're going to look at how to save a document in Photoshop. So here I have my Squiggle Lines project. I'm just going to save this and upload it to Classroom. So wherever you are here, and it could be any project, on the File, Save As, just like this. I'm going to make sure I give this a name. Okay, now what I want to do is I'm going to save this. I'm going to choose to save it on the desktop, but you could save it in a folder if that's more familiar to you. I'm going to save it on the desktop because it's easier to find. It's also not a bad idea to change your format. Uh, easier to read in Classroom, so I'm going to change this into a JPEG. And that's pretty much it. Now I just hit Save. This stuff doesn't really matter. I'll just hit OK. And it should be done. So now I can get out of Photoshop. And somewhere in all this junk is my squiggle lines. Uh, well, it's in there somewhere. We'll find it. There it is. There and there. So now what I'm going to do is I go back here. Uh, I'm in my Google Classroom. Here's my squiggle lines project that I want to turn in, right here. So I'm going to click open. And then what I'm going to do is add a file. Now I can either, probably the easiest way to do it, if I know where it is, is I can just grab it and drop it like this. Or you can also add more files and here I am on the desktop, and I find my other Squiggle Lines project. I'll do this one, and I can hit Open. And then you just hit Upload, and here they come. I'm going to upload two of them this time. Done, done, done. And when I'm all finished here, I just hit Turn In. It asks, you sure you want to turn these in? I tell you, yep, I'm going to turn them in. And it marks it as done. And then when I go back to Google Classroom, I get a little mark right here that says that it's done. So that's it. That's how to save a project in Photoshop and upload to Google Classroom.